Hello guys, let me show you Anacubic Cobra 2 Pro 3D printer. Just, uh, just a quick look. Filament sensor. Direct extruder, direct drive extruder. Two Z axis connected with uh, belt. He has uh, one uh, motor. It's okay, it's not the biggest uh, printer, it's just 220, 220, 250. It's more or less standard in these days. So you can tension your belts. Very nice, very nice. Have very, very powerful uh, filament cooling fa fan. It's just this one. But it's it's really a silent fan. If you compare to Creality K1 or Bambula P1, it's silent. <laughs> because it's those printers, it's impossible to have at, at, at home. It's for office use or something. But this one, it's real silent. You can print and wow. And I won't show you what I printed. I printed uh, this model, it's uh, 200 millimeters. My window was open and I get these lines. I'm using uh, Silk Pella Plus from Anacubic. No problems with, with the print, printing, with the angles and so on, but I don't like these lines. So I closed my window and I reprinted. Check this out. Huge difference. It's, this print is absolutely not bad print. It's just I don't like these lines. Because it's this printer have no enclosure, that's why I get this temperature changes or, or, or something. I think that's why those lines it came. Because I reprinted with the same settings and it's wow. Check this out. You can connect to USB stick or you can print direct from the cloud. Just install uh, an Acubic application and you're ready to go. Even you can monitor your prints. Next time when you print your model, this printer has memory inside so you no need to slice or something. You just can use the same file. Shows four hours two minutes, but actually it's a uh, little bit uh, wrong. It's printed in uh, less time, in uh, three hours, 44 minutes or something. Unbelievable, especially for this kind of printer and for this price guys you just forget to get something better for this price especially now when it's black friday i going to add link below so you can check if you like to buy this printer or you're interesting to get one very clean this inch of course it's auto leveling model calibration vibration compensation and so on not not even that but this printer listen now you no need to adjust nozzle heat it does for you automatically so you get super first layer it's very important for uh, 3d printing beginners because you know first layer it's first layer even if your printer have auto leveling so just forget it is printer. One button, you're ready to go. Print, and that's it. You get what you see. That's what I really like. That's how this printer made, and all printers must be like this. I, I self don't like uh, to mix, you know, play with a clipper or something. I, I just want to print. I just want to get my prints from the printer. And this printer does it, this job beautiful. Show you, check this out. 
like you understand, this printer can uh, print in very fast speeds. Metallic wheels. Here also. It moves, wow. Very nice. Not on Z axis, because it's no need. Z don't move so fast, so it, it, it's okay. Came with uh, flex plate, just one side. Then you can actually use both sides. You can um, make your own, just use uh, some uh, double-sided tape and some kind of pet plastic sheet if you don't like this original plate from Anacubic. But I, I, I like it, sticks very okay. I am uh, use it for my uh, prints uh, on a cubic slicer. What I done, just an enable uh, nozzle hopping, because it's from one part to another part, because sometimes, you know, nozzle can damage your prints. Especially when you printer, you have no encloser. It's whole slicer, it's not bad. It's uh, no problems at all. Of course, you can um, use this printer with Kura, with Orca slicer, it's up to you. But I like this uh, Anacubic uh, slicer. It's simple, very easy to use. And That's it, guys. This is a quick look at the uh, Anacubic Cobra 2 Pro 3D printer. I self very like this printer I getting very very good prints even with original slicer it's uh, this time Anacubic made really really good job auto leveling no need heat adjusting for your no nozzle filament sensor, direct ex extruder, this tube, uh, teflon tube is just a guide for your filament. Enjoy, subscribe and more videos coming soon.